Hello everyone, welcome to Natus and Aptitude 1. In this video, I am going to explain 51st problem of crypt arithmetic multiplication in crypt arithmetic series. CAW into ANE that is equal to WARANC. We will find out the value of W plus A plus R plus A plus N plus C. Here three digit number into three digit number the result is equal to six digits. Now we will find the value. Before that uh, first we will check any clue is exist in this question or not. A plus E is equal to A. Now what is the value of A? What is the value of E? E is equal to 0 or 9. As per our rule for the arithmetic addition, E is equal to 0 or 9. Suppose E is equal to 0, then what happened? This entire row is equal to 0. That's not possible. So what is the value of A? So what is the value of E? That is equal to 9. That is the fix. Now, you will write down the 9 wherever E exists. Only two cases. Now A plus E and suppose if you take the leftmost column, these two digits are different. These two letters are different. When suppose one carry is generated in this column, then one is carry here, then 1 plus D is equal to W, then only these two are distant values. Right? In this case, here we know that 1 plus D is equal to W that implies D and W are consecutive numbers. Are consecutive numbers. And here W is greater than D. Is it clear? W is greater than D. Now there are three numbers are there and three numbers just write down uh, like this that is equal to C A W into 9 that is equal to N N R C C A W into N that is equal to A A V R C A W into A that is equal to D E C D. What is the value of E that is equal to 9? Uh, just write down 9 wherever E exists, only one case. And next, already uh, we already we write down that is equal to 9. What is the condition W is greater than D and W and D are consecutive numbers or not? Now you will check where W and D is anywhere in this case. C. W A into W that is equal to D. Now you will write down, you will hit the trial and error the value of W. Before that, you must know W is an even number or an odd and odd number. Suppose W is an even number, if you multiply this even number with any number, either even or odd, then that result is equal to an even number or not. Then these two numbers are not consecutive numbers. Right? Now, if W is an odd number, then what happens? If you multiply this odd number with even number, then this number is equal to even number. So, double even. this is odd number and this is even number. Consecutive number is possible. And suppose this is an odd number and A is also odd number. Odd number into odd number. That is equal to odd number. Then that is not possible. So, what happened? W must be an odd number and E must be an even number. And next, let us take W is equal to 3. W is equal to 3. What is the smallest possibility? That is equal to 3. If W is equal to 3, then what is the value of D? D must be equal to 2 or not. Why? Because 1 plus D, that is equal to W. Right? If W is equal to 3, then what is the value of D? That is equal to 2. Right? When it is possible, if you multiply this 3 with this A, then that is equal to 2. Only uh, one case. Why? Because A must be single digit. Right? 
If a is equal to 4, 4 into 3 that is equal to 12, 2 and 1 carry over here. Then this is satisfy the condition. Now you will write down uh, 3 wherever w is exist. And what about d that is equal to 2? This is equal to 2. Right? And next this is also equal to 4. This is equal to 4. And next, 4 into 3, that is equal to 12, 1 carry over here. 4 into 4, there goes 16. 16 plus 1, that is equal to 17. So, what is the value of C? C is equal to 7. Now, you will substitute the value of 7 wherever C exists. That is equal to 7. Right? Now, if you check whether this is satisfied or not, 4 into 3, that is equal to 12, 1 carry over, 4 into 4, 16 plus 1, 17, 1 carry over, 4 into 7, 28 plus 1, 29, so all conditions are satisfied in this case. And A is equal to 4, and this is equal to 7, 4, 3, and next, this is 7, 4, 3, and what is the, this one equal to 7, or do we know that value? And simply, you will multiply these values, 7 into 9 into 3, that will 27, 7, 2 carry over, 9 into 4, 36 plus 2, 38, so 8 and 3, 9 into 7, that is equal to 63 plus 3, that is equal to 66, so all conditions are satisfied. Now you will substitute the value of n, that is equal to 6, where n is exist. And what is the value of R that is equal to 8? Just write down 8. And e, A that is equal to 4. And next, uh, what is the sum of this one? 4 plus uh, 6 plus 4. And this is equal to 8. So 1 carry over must be here. 1 is generated, 1 is, carry 1 is generated here. And next, uh, uh, this is equal to 4. 4 plus 9, 13. And 1 must be carry generated in this column. So that is also satisfy the condition. And next, what is the value of n? n is equal to 6 or not. If you multiply this n is equal to 6, write down n is equal to 6. And already we know that r is equal to 8. 6 into 3, 18, 1 carry over. And 6 into 4, 24 plus 1, 25. So this is equal to 5, 2, 42 plus 2, 44. That is also satisfied. So what is the value of V? That is equal to 5. What is the value of A? That is equal to 4. That's all. Just a small clue is here. One is E and another one is D and W are consecutive numbers where W is greater than D. Right? Using this clue, we will find out all the values. Right? Now, what we require? Some of these values. So, that is equal to 3 plus 4 plus 8 plus 4 plus 6 plus 7. So, uh, this is equal to 10 and 10, 20, 20 uh, plus 8, 28 plus 4. That is equal to 32, which is required answer. That's all in this video. Uh, dear students, no need to uh, think out of the box, etc. It's a very simple. You will find out any clue is exist or not. If you crack the clue, then this question is very simple. Otherwise, big difficult is there, right? So uh, stay uh, tuned my channel. You will get more updates in crypt arithmetic. In future, I will find I will explain crypt arithmetic subtraction and division problems also. That's all for today and thank you one and all.